Hello and welcome. My name is Amuli and you are watching YouTube Mint. In this video, we are going to have a look at WordPress 2020 just released with 6.4, WordPress 6.4 release. And it is a great lightweight theme and has been released with lots of improvements. So let's go ahead and have a look at the, the new customizer which is now site editor or edit site so you can see the customizer has been renamed to edit site on the top na admin navbar and if you go to dashboard and under appearance if you have already activated wordpress 2024 theme uh, under appearance okay something happened here you do not have lots of nav items you only have editor okay so that will take you to the site edit which was previously as a customizer for a classic theme but this is a blog based theme and you can see uh, the slug also has been changed to site hyphen editor.php and this gives you a lot more flexibility as a non-coder so you can see here got design section and then under design we have navigation styles so under styles you have very specific presets that are already defined in a theme.json or you can have a look if you are interested in but this is a great sort of style or preset theme preset what i would call you can also go ahead and simply uh, understand under styles you can define your own presets and then refer them into this json a theme.json so i'll go with the ember and that was already there navigation you got the first navigation already on the top navigation and uh, you can basically add uh, edit so once you click on edit button you can click on the specific navigation let's say i want to delete this so as soon as i click that it will be highlighted and then i can move let's say right right and if i wish i can use these change the slug etc and then copy duplicate etc and let's say i want to remove it so that was basically duplicate and has been removed this is how you can play with the navigation items and it says and this is where the edit was done now you can save it and it's saving and you'll get a message here okay so a bit slow maybe maybe it's my system okay so you also have some options here remove my account and you can click that to go back to the nav design nav and then you have pages so all the pages that you have added will be listed here you can manage all pages that will open a new window oh it takes you to the post editor pages list basically which is great but i see it's taking a bit longer okay so you can manage all pages right there 
okay and then we have templates so these are templates that are basically created in PHP uh, templates not not PHP HTML these are all templates that you can see basically it uses lots of CSS classes block CSS classes WordPress block group alignment etc classes and that's great now you can go to patterns basically this is where it uses PHP declaration little bit about the uh, patterns more like the templates in the a classic theme and then again it's going to use uh, div which is HTML and then lots of CSS which are going to be the WordPress Gutenberg block classes CSS classes okay so you can manage all templates and let's see where it takes you to so right here in the new window and then what else we have uh, we have patterns that we already have seen so these are basically built in pattern with the theme that you can use but uh, this lock symbolizes that you cannot edit them <laughs> so you cannot edit them but you can use them which is great okay template parts which we already have seen before you can add your one so i think that's a really great improvement with this 6.4 release of 2024 uh, block based theme and this enables lots of uh, non coders to start customizing and creating a specific anything that is needed for their specific requirement that's great so now let's quickly check how it looks so we have taken the ember uh, preset this is how it looks let's go to blog listing page this is really good design principle that I can see being followed on this page here and now you have your blog posts watch read and listen so this means you can post text video and audio okay let's go to single blog post and now you have navigation buttons a bit faster okay then you can go to shop page if you have a WooCommerce already installed and activated. So this is how the WooCommerce with this um, 2014 theme and it's a preset variant Ember it looks like. And you can basically Add to cart is a bit faster than the classic theme, I would say. And then you can go to cart. It's being processed with PHP. Obviously, there is a JAX, but it is taking a bit longer. Okay, now you can go and proceed to the checkout page. I have a coupon that's not a good practice <laughs> right on the top no somewhere at the bottom I guess would be best practice okay so all right guys I think and this blog based theme is getting into right direction and it really enables a lot so uh, small businesses to start their website start selling products and 
that's it for this video in upcoming video of blog based themes i will try to go with specific features of blog based themes customizations and adding new features new templates new patterns thank you for watching bye for now